Hey everyone, it's Lane with Windows10Update.com and today we're going to be showing you six more really great apps for people going back to school. Whether that's because you are a teacher or a student, whether in high school or in college, these apps will be great for you. The first one that we want to take a look at is called GeoBoard. Now this one really is best for teachers, probably elementary school or middle school teachers who are teaching geometry. So this app is a virtual version of a physical geo board where you would take a rubber band and kind of stretch it over these different uh, pegs here to create different shapes. So as you can see, this app is really not meant for someone who is in college themselves, but definitely for teachers in middle school or in elementary school who have access to Windows 8.1 or Windows 10 PCs in the classroom. All right, the next app we want to take a look at is Microsoft OneNote Mobile. So OneNote Mobile you can download right from the store and it's free and it's a very powerful application. Although it's not quite as powerful as the version that was available in Windows 8.1, um, it will get there over time. Microsoft is making constant improvements to this application. So as you can see here, you can have multiple notebooks and then within those notebooks you can create different notebooks, notebook sections, excuse me, and then individual pages underneath that. Now these pages can go on for miles and miles in any direction. So you can, you can continue to create in any direction on this page. The page can have as much information as you would like. If you have a device like the Surface 3 or Surface Pro 3, there's some advanced drawing uh, features right within the app so you can take physical notes draw diagrams things like that and then these notes are searchable within OneNote. And in addition to that you can also insert different things like a table um, different files can be attached to it you can take pictures with the camera insert other pictures or make a link to a web page or to another page within the OneNote notebook. So this application is very powerful uh, and it's very helpful for organization, especially maybe for a student who has a lot of notes to take throughout their various different classes. Um, this is a really great application for that. All right, and the next app we want to take a look at is called No Textbooks. One of the biggest problems with college is all of the textbooks that you have to take with you to school, carrying them around. They are heavy, they hurt your back, they hurt your shoulders, your neck. And uh, they can be difficult to keep track of. If you forget one of your uh, important textbooks at home, that can be a big hassle. So imagine having all of those textbooks available to you right on your device. So that really limits the amount of weight and the number of things that you have to remember. So I haven't registered for this no textbooks application. I'm not in college right now, so I haven't done that. But had I done that, I would be able to go through this store and browse all the different books, search for the different books using an ISBN or keyword to find that book, or you can search by the title or author as well. So this app is really great for students, especially those in college. All right, along the same lines of no textbooks is Course Smart e-textbooks. So it's basically the same same concept as no textbooks. Um, like I said, I'm not in college, so I haven't had an opportunity to explore these. There may be differences in what books are available between these two applications. So you might want to give each of these out. Uh, you know, you can have a demo try of this app and see how you like it and uh, see which one you like better. All right, the next app we want to take a look at is really best for teachers. Again, probably elementary or middle school teachers. So what you can do is you can separate out the different classes. So this helps you organize the different classes that you teach and helps you to remember your students. So within this application, you can keep pictures of your students, maybe to help you remember, your, remember their names if you do have a lot of different students. And then you can keep information about those students, their performance, their grades, and things like that right there within the application, which will make it a lot easier for you to track all of that. So this right here is just a tour that I'm going through that they have in the application to kind of show you what the application does. So as you can see here, there's information about attendance. You can keep that in there. If you wanted to have a Skype call with their parents or just you know make a phone call to them, you can do that right from within the application or send an email. So this makes it really easy for teachers to keep in touch with the students and their parents 
and then keep track of all of that relevant information. This I could imagine being very helpful to teachers uh, around the time of parent-teacher conferences. So definitely a great app to look at if you are a teacher. And then the last application we want to take a look at today is Newegg. Now you've probably heard of Newegg. It's really not a back-to-school application. However, it could be great for students, especially those in college or maybe even high school who need to purchase something uh, relating to back to school. So Newegg is going to be having a lot of sales since we're going into the back to school season on things like laptops, tablets, hard drives, things like that. So if you want to get a new PC or upgrade your PC or purchase different things for it uh, before you go back to school, this would be a great application to have. Uh, it's definitely very handy for helping you stay aware of different sales that are happening. As well, if you're a parent of a student and you want to be maybe purchasing something for that student in the coming weeks here, this app could also help you uh, as you prepare for that. Thanks for joining us today. There will be another video featuring six more great back-to-school apps tomorrow. Thanks for watching.